Hey guys, for today's video, I'm gonna show you all of my indoor birds. So let's get started. So up first are my pet parakeets. And this is their cage. I try to um, use all safe toys and perches for them. And they have quite a big, what I like to call their aviary. And they free roam too, but this is plenty enough room for them, so. That is Chuck, and I got him from a rescue. He has a lot of friends. He's very popular. The um, olive color one is Mossy Oak. That one is Jimbo. Blue one. The one next to Mossy Oak is Tyrone. That's Tweety, my girl. That's Lime, my, one of my boys. That's Melon, one of my girls. Down there is my pair, Loki. And then my female, Sky. And then this another one of my pairs, Lemon and Herman. And then Dobby is next to, oh my gosh, there we go, you Dobby is right there and he was next to Loki. And I literally just cleaned them out yesterday but they are messy when they eat but yeah those are all of my parakeets my finches I have some society finches some are crested as you can see they're just like little top hats and some aren't crested I love the crested that's one of my weavers they're molting that's why they look like that and they're also constantly baiting and that's my other weaver who is also molting and getting on his summer coat which is going to be very pretty but yeah, they look kind of naked because they're molting. It's kind of freaky. But yeah, these are my society finches and weavers. And they have a very decent sized cage. Again, with a ton of different types of perches. And they also have a bath because they like to bathe a lot. This is Ernie, one of my African doves. And that is his girlfriend. And they're sitting on fake eggs right now. And I use two types of locks for the cages just to make sure it's safe. Okay, so here we have Bert and Snow White, which funny enough, I got Bert for Ernie and Bert turned out to be a boy as well. I got Bert from a rescue. It's kind of dark in here. But that's Snow White and that's Bert. And they have a very, very big cage. Honestly, gigantic. But it's perfect for them because it has a bar spacing that's appropriate. So their bar spacing is only appropriate for the doves, hence why they have the largest cage. And they also have a large seed netting because they get upset from the other birds. Okay, so in here is one of my favorite birds. They are my cockatiels, and I have four, and I'll just kind of show you guys them. And they free range a lot, but they love each other so much, and their cage has a lot of different perches for them. So they're used to free flying a lot, so they want to come out. But this is, let's show you guys. This is my baby Apache. This thing. And this is Apache. Stop up, baby. This is Chiefy, who wants the free roam, because they're used to free roaming a lot. That's Comanche, who is my first one, and he is a, let me try to show him better. He didn't like the camera. He is a pied cockatiel, and he was my first ever cockatiel. He is stretching right now. And then Chief is a pearl, who's, as he gets older, might lose some of it. And then that's Apache, also male. And this is Shoshone, 
who is a full of like voices. Him and Chief both sing. If you're happy and you know it, and they do the wolf whistle. The other boys don't really sing those songs, but they sing a lot too. And yeah, he is a normal type. So I have four cockatiels. I love them so much. And this is their cage, and they fear them a lot. But the four of them get along so well, this cage just works out perfect for them. I'm not going to open their cages just because they will escape. They're very friendly, but they love to free roam, and they already free roamed all day. Hi, Cannoli. So, Cannoli just got some flour. So, that's Cannoli. I got him from a fellow bird person who is a friend of mine who had to get rid of their two conures. So, I took in Cannoli. So, Cannoli is a yellow-sided green cheek conure. And he is very, very cute and very sweet. And he loves seeds. And then I'll get them a sunflower too. I feel bad. But this is Mango and Kiwi. And Mango's a boy. Mango is my first conure. Kiwi, I don't know if they're a boy or girl. I'm going to get you a sunflower seed. Don't worry. Kiwi's so cute. But don't. Okay, so in here I have the conure that came with cannoli but they don't get along and this is my baby so this is kiko and kiko is my oldest conure and he's so freaking cute very similar to mango but just a thinner body shape and uh kiko does go out when the birds go out but he just tends to stick on you and not fly away he does have some hormonal characteristics that make him a funny bird. But yeah. Let's go away, buddy. His cage, he is not in the cage with them because he doesn't get along with them. And that's completely fine. Not all birds have to get along. You have to be prepared for that. But yeah, he's over here and he keeps my baby company. So this is my baby, Blue Bear. So this is Baby Blue. And Baby Blue is a yellow-sided turquoise green sheet conure. And Blue looks really stuffed right now. But, um, wanna see your wings, baby? Good. Kind of teach him to show his wings. Okay, good boy. He's so cute. Can I step up? Come on, baby. Good boy. At lunch. Thank you.